Hi guys! Today I have a super fun hairstyling vid for you. Um, it's just three different ways to style your hair with a ball cap in under five minutes. When you're gonna wear a baseball cap, or at least a lot of the girls I know and myself, um, you've got little time. I guess little time, little cares, or I don't know, just you a little want to look like a cool chick that didn't take a million years on her hair. So whatever your reasoning for it, here are three different ways to style your hair with a baseball hat. Okay, so my hair looks a little nuts right now, don't mind the caveman vibes. Um, the hat that I'm going to be using is this LA Dodgers hat. It is from Lids and their collab with Levi's. They come in light and dark denim. This one's obviously the light one, but it's just got white stitching on there and then the back is adjustable. So we're gonna start off super simple and I'm just gonna do a side pony. So go ahead and pull it to whichever side you want your pony on. Grab your hair tie. You know, put it in a ponytail as I'm sure you know how to do. I like the front to be loose, so if it goes over my ears or like pull little bits out, whatever you think, um, I don't get too crazy with my ponytails. Um, untangle it from your earring, always a good choice. And what you're gonna do to spice it up a little bit is take a section from the outer corner, corner, because <laughs> ponytails have corners. I don't know, the outer edge of your ponytail. Split it into two pieces. Take a little piece from one of the sides, go under the middle, then go over the other one. Take a piece from that side, go under that side, and over the other. Then I just tighten that a little bit. And if you're gonna keep doing this braid all the way down, you would keep adding on each side, but you don't need to do that because it doesn't have to go um, all the way down. So you just keep doing that. So you go under and then over to that side, under, over to that side. I think this is called an infinity braid. Um, so that's where you get that under and over from is the infinity part. And I'm just gonna do that until I get far enough down. So once you've got this little bit, what you're gonna do is wrap it around that base of your ponytail. I'm gonna take a spin pin to secure it. You can also use just a bobby pin. Put the coil in the back, and then spin that through the base of the ponytail. So this look is obviously super simple. It's just a little twist on a side ponytail but I think it gives it a little something extra and it gives you some practice with an infinity braid so that way once you master this you can move into doing like all of your hair in a big one um, but it's a good little braid to have in your arsenal um, and I, I wrap it around ponytails like that all the time because I think it gives it a little something. So the next two styles um, are both pigtails and I'm going to start with the pigtail messy buns. So I just put the hat on, I didn't part my hair because it doesn't matter, nobody's going to see it. Um, so just somewhat evenly divide your hair into two. Take your little hair ties, put the ponytails in right, let's do that corner thing again, on the corners of your head. So <laughs> you have a head, uh, the corners of your head. So you're not going to put these on the back of your skull, you're going to put it more where um, your neck meets your ear, kind of, so that you can see it from the front and then the back, obviously. I feel like we'd be good to go from here, but if you want to spice it up a little bit, all I'm going to do from here, I'm going to wrap it one final time and leave a little loop at the bottom, and then I tighten it from there. We'll see if I can get this to find me. You're going to take the tail wrap it around through the loop you made. I'm going to go around again and just kind of secure it down here. And it's okay if it's a little messy. Um, these make me think of like flower bulbs. I don't really know why they kind of sprout. Maybe we'll go with that. So these are basically just um, low space buns. So however you like to do those, I know a ton of people have a ton of different methods, but this is how I created these. 
So for the last look, um, before you put the hat on, I'm just gonna basically separate my hair in half. So I'm gonna pick up the top half and put it through this hole. From here, I am going to turn stuff around for you. I'll split my hair that's in the hat into two. And then just kind of split my hair also that's below the hat. And I'm just gonna work with this half right now. So I'm gonna take what's coming through the hat on the left, and I'm going to split it into three and start a touch braid. the base of your neck. I'm going to hold that there and pancake a little bit. Take a clear elastic just because they are easier to hide. I guess you don't see them as obviously. I'm just going to tie that off like that and I'm going to repeat on the other side. to do with like second, third, fourth, fifth day curls um, just so that your ponies will have a little something more um, or straight hair is obviously just fine too. This is kind of just my natural like fifth day hair. It's not really doing anything um, which is kind of when you wear a baseball cap. So um, this is the third look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you recreate any of these and you love how they turn out or you hate how they turn out and you want me to know please leave me a dm or let me know on messages here but i love to see when you guys recreate it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll talk to you soon bye